Hi, in this video I'll show you how to reset and clear out the cache for Teams if you're using the web app or if you're using the Teams app on a device, in a Windows 10 device. These are steps that teachers and students can do. They also help if there's any changes to Teams, such as student display names or student profile pics. This would update it for the students and teachers. This is a good practice for the whole class to do, for the teacher to do, and the students as well. So the first thing I'll show you is how to clear the cache within the Chrome web browser. This will really help if you're using the Teams web browser uh, version to get to your Teams meetings. The second thing I'll show you is how to just sign out, sign back into the Teams app on a Windows 10 device for a teacher or a student. Again, these are great ways just to kind of reset Teams. If you're having any troubles with Teams, these are also good things to kind of reset, kind of start it up so it's all fresh and new uh, with all the settings. So the first thing we'll do is in the Chrome web browser on your device, in the top right hand corner, click the More menu. And then you're gonna click History. You can get here with the shortcut key, Control H as well. Just click History. Then on the left-hand side, click Browsing, Clear Browsing Data. From here, you wanna choose the drop-down setting of all time, and then click the blue button that says Clear Data. And that will clear the cache on the Chrome web browser. That's a great way to reset all of those settings if you're using the web-based version of Teams. So once you clear that data. The next thing is the Teams app on a Windows 10 device. To do that, in the very top, you're gonna to click your profile pic. And when you click on that profile pic, you'll be able to sign out of Teams and, you'll be, and it will pop right back up for you to sign in. So we're gonna click on the profile pic in the very top right hand corner. When you click that, click sign out. And then it signs out and it pops right back to sign back in. Just sign in with your district email address and sign in. And you've cleared the Teams app to kind of start with those different settings uh, to be in place. So anytime you need to have student display names or you need to have profile pics changed, just set the whole class, teacher, students to do that, or any troubles that are going on with Teams, that's another great way uh, to just sign out, sign back in, or clear the cache in the web browser. Thank you.